Okay, welcome back to another mathematics video brought to you by the NMBEC Maths Department. We are still going through the Year 10 mock exam. This is question 4 of the calculator paper. It's a very, very nice estimate mean question, something that no one should ever get wrong if you're doing any paper, whether it's the high order foundation. Uh, so this one's four marks, which it generally is, uh, sometimes three, but if it's a uh, a group data then f usually four marks the table gives information about the speeds of 85 motorbikes on a road uh, you can see the speeds on the left hand side which are grouped and then you've got the frequency for each one so we've got nine people who have gone between a speed of 30 seconds and 40 seconds a very straightforward basic estimated mean question okay so whenever we have a look uh, if it's group data then what we need is a midpoint and that's why these columns are here so in this column over here we can say these are going to be my midpoints so let's just write midpoints over here and the midpoints go from the speed so between 30 and 40 is 35 between 40 and 50 is 45 between 50 and 60 is 55 and lastly between 60 and 70 is 65 now if you look at a book on the internet there is a formula and they say that the estimated mean which is what we're doing is given by sigma fx over sigma f sigma is just a greek word for total and so this is the total of fx divided by the total of f so the total of f is the total of your frequencies which is this bit over here so we can add them all together but sometimes in the question it tells you how many things or how many people are in your survey uh, so over here we've got 85 so if i was to add the 9 the 25 the 34 and the 17 that should give me 85 and that's going to be my sigma f the total of my frequencies now sigma fx is the total of my frequency times this thing called x and when we have the midpoint x is my midpoint so in this column over here we can have f times x which is just going to be my frequency times my midpoint so this one over here i'll just work out the i'll do the working for this one only so this one will be 9 times 35 which will be 315 uh, this one over here will be 20 well i'll just write in 25 times 45 which is 1125 the one below it so that will be 34 times 55 which would be 1870 and then finally we got 17 times 65 which is 1105 now if we just include a total box over here this essentially is my sigma fx and that's the total of the frequencies times the midpoints and we should have 4 4 1 5 so to work out your estimated mean it's going to be the total of your fx divided by your total of frequencies so it'll just be 4 4 1 5 which has come from here divided by your total frequency which comes from here which is 85 oh, and that gives you 51.9 i've rounded that up and so my answer would be 51.9 kilometers per hour and that's four marks nicely done